If you are experiencing lower FPS and poor performance out of your PC in Fortnite, so guys, I also go through it. And here's my FPS before doing this tweak, and here's my FPS after doing these changes. So guys, in this video, I'm going to show you the best Fortnite game use settings changes you need to apply right now on your PC in order to get a huge FPS increase in Fortnite. Guys, in the very first step here, I made a pre-edited game use settings for the Fortnite that you can download from my official website, link in the description. Here you will find this file that is the best game use settings. You need to simply open up the folder and inside you will find out these files that is the high-end PC, low-end PC and mid-end PC. I have made here the custom resolution for you that you can use to go into your PC build and guys it is very easy to use like you need to just simply open up any folder, copy this file and paste it in your Fortnite directory and you will get all the settings in just one click. But guys this video is mainly about how you can apply the settings manually in Fortnite game user settings. So for that you need to press Windows R together from your keyboard and you will find out this kind of the run window. So simply type here percentage local app data percentage sign and hit ok now you will find out this from the directory so press f from your keyboard and find out fortnite game folder go inside it go for saved config windows client and here you will find out your game user settings you need to just simply replace this file if you want to use the best game user settings file pack so guys but we are doing it manually so first of all you need to go for properties of your this file and make sure to uncheck this read only box because it will allow you to make the changes inside this file now hit apply and click ok now right click again go for show more and open up it with the edit so guys here we got over fortnite game you setting file and now from here you need to make all these changes so guys the first settings that you need to make here that is the motion blur settings and guys you need to set it onto the force for disabling the motion blur on your pc next here we go to this show grass option and you need to disable the grass in fortnite in order to get the better performance so guys simply type here f a l f e false and guys that's it now next you need to find out here this option that is the stop rendering in the background and you need to go for it and simply set it on to the true this is the new option to stop the rendering in the background therefore we can get the most performance in the foreground the next here we find out our latency tweak one you need to simply set it on the false latency tweak two set it on to the one this doesn't matter because we have disabled the uh, first settings now if you just scroll down you will find out here the settings that is the uh, dlss quality i have set it on the three the next here we go x e ss quality i have also set it on the two now next scroll down and here you will find out use the night i have set it on the fourth these settings are only affected when you are using the directx 12 on your pc now next here we find out these settings that is the ray tracing 120 fps mode these are again effective in the directx 12 but here are the settings that is the 120 fps you need to guys simply set it on the fours if you have logged your fps on 120 so this is important settings you need to disable so make sure to set it on to the fours now next here we find out front end frame rate limit set it on to the 120 fps the next here we go the most important settings that is the energy saved enable so guys you need to go for it and simply set the settings onto the false because we not want to save our power in the exchange of performance so we need the best performance out of our system while we're playing fortnite so you need to disable the settings next again we find out here this energy saving enable focus loose so go for this option and set it onto the false again and disable the settings next here we find energy saving level we have set it onto the false so it doesn't matter now scroll down and here you will find out this comes the list before the resolution and here is the option that is the low input latency mode is enabled. Make sure guys turn on for getting the low latency out of your mouse and keyboard while playing Fortnite. Now next here we find out our resolution. This is guys your personal preference. You can ask me in the command and I will give you the best resolution according to your PC specs. So guys I'm using the native that is the 920 by 1080 p and this works best for me. Now scroll down, here we go to this frame rate limit. I have set it onto the unlimited, so you need to set it onto the 0, 0.000. Next, scroll down, and here is the scalability group settings. Now the first setting that you change here, that is the resolution quality. By default, it is onto the 100%, that is the maximum, but guys, you need to change the settings onto the 85% for getting more FPS while playing Fortnite. Now next, here we find out view distance, set it onto the zero, and in the quality, set it onto the zero shadow quality set it on to zero 
global illumination quality set it onto the zero, reflection quality set it onto the zero, post processing quality set it onto the zero, texture quality set it onto the zero, effect quality also set it onto the zero, foolish quality set it onto the zero, shading quality simply set it onto the zero, and at the end landscape quality also make sure to set it onto the zero. By setting all the settings onto the lowest level, you will definitely get more FPS and performance out of your PC. Now here is some other settings that the chat setting, but it doesn't impact your performance. So simply just skip all the settings. After doing it, you need to go for the file option, hit save and guys, that's it. And guys also keep in mind, these settings is only work with your performance mode. So therefore make sure to enable the performance mode on your PC, always to get the best performance and better FPS in Fortnite. So guys, after doing it, go for file, hit save, and save all the settings on your PC. After that, close out of it. Now simply launch your Fortnite and enjoy the best performance out of your PC. I hope so you love it. Please make sure to let me know your opinion about this video in the comment below. And I will see you in the next video.